Bugoma Forest is a tropical rainforest located in Chikuve district in the southwestern part of Uganda. The 400 square kilometer forest is also known as a habitat to 38 species of mammals, which four are globally threatened and nine are listed in the International Union for Conservation of Nature's Red List. On the 14th of August 2020, after an environmental and social impact assessment, NEMA approved a sugar plantation project with stringent conditions given to Hoima Sugar Limited as it was allocated 22 square miles in the Changwali sub-county, part of Bugoma Forest. But according to NEMA, Hoima Sugar Limited have gone on to abuse the agreement. We are not stopping sugar production. What we are saying is that the land which was allocated for sugar which is uh, nine square miles, should be exactly that. There shouldn't be any inch beyond the land authorized for sugar. Our argument, our, our biggest problem, is degradation of land which is not meant for sugar cane growing. While addressing journalists today at their head offices, NEMA Executive Director, Dr. Ankwasa Barirega, revealed that Hoima Sugar had violated all the approval conditions around Bugoma Forest. Our inspection team visited the area and the Hoima Sugar staff were on the ground. They were, they were interacted with. Uh, we have footage, including uh, aerial drone footage, to confirm uh, uh, what we are saying. So there is all the evidence uh, that Hoima Sugar Limited uh, cannot refute the fact that there is uh, degradation of the areas which were supposed to remain naturally uh, forested areas, and so they are fully aware. According to NEMA, the forest has been severely degraded. National Environment Management Authority has also threatened to terminate the certificate which was awarded to Hoima Sugar Limited if they do not comply. Uh, we have issued um, this order to them, so they have already received it, so they have it. They have the order. The authority has also issued stringent guidelines to Hoima Sugar Limited to avoid any further damage to the environment. These include immediately stopping any further deforestation of natural reserved forest areas, no sugar cane should be planted in the natural reserved areas, hold giving away 312 hectares earlier approved for an urban center, restore all degraded areas, prepare a restoration plan, implement the restoration plan, and permit that parties who may wish to participate in restoration. For long, there has been a protracted legal battle between members of the civil society under the Save Bugoma Forest campaign and businessmen who have been demanding to have a chunk of the forest for sugarcane growing. Martha Amanya, CTV, PM Edition.